Yeah, how's it going, everyone? Maryland here. And that's right, it's time for more Animal Crossing. Hopefully, internet will cooperate today. I'm starting to think it's actually my modem. <laughs> uh, yeah, but anyway, it looks fine, which is good. Did we set it yesterday after the stream? I increase stream quality right now. Good. Anyway, it is time for Stitches to move in today. I'm excited for that. I wonder... Or no, we already know where he'll move in. He's moving into the village. <laughs> uh, where he was moving in yesterday. Did I update the title or is Twitch Borking? That would be Twitch Borking. I know I updated the title. But I'll do it again, just in case. <laughs> oh, Twitch! Anyway, how's it going, Artemu? Uh, Spacey Phoenix and Shripa. Get this party started here. How's it going, Veteran Umbreon? Say hi to Stitches. Which won't let you buy bits? What? I mean, after last week, <laughs> they're probably like, yo, you better slow down a little. <laughs> All right, let's see what is going on today. This lovely Tuesday crashes right at checkout. Mm. Oh, Twitch, you having one of those days? E, that's concerning though. Hey, how's it going, Max LP Queen? A news moved into town today. Hey, I wonder who that could be. Yes, it is stitches. I'm excited. All right, uh, what do we have? White rose right there, which we really don't need, but I guess I'll put it. How's it going, Shiny Misty? And gaming fan, Verithin? Ooh, more purple roses. That's exciting. Now I actually have quite a few. What are these? Still trying to get blue roses. I mean, it's kind of a silly goal, but I feel like I can do it. In fact, it's arguably easier now that there's not like a ton of flowers all around, so I feel like it's something that I could do. Like once you have a sea of flowers, it gets a little tough. All right, two letters. We have one from Eloise and one from Cyrano, okay. How's it going, Tiger Fire? Yes, or Tiger, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, we have stitches now. Oh, nice, Shiny Misty. All right, let's see. Eloise, sorry for barging my way, my way in the other day. Please take this with my apologies. You already have everything you need, so it's time to focus on what you want. You weren't really barging in, I mean. <laughs> Ew, that sounds a little extreme here. Uh, ooh, a regal bed. That's, that's pretty nice. I don't need it, but it's nice. Uh, to Oliver, thanks for coming over the other day. We're friends, you know. You can always be straightforward with me. To show I'm serious, I sent you a little gift. Take it. All right, Sierra, now what did you send me? It is a microscope. Oh, that'll show that, that you're serious. Oh, ho! All right, let's stop by the house because I wanted to try something out with these editor's chairs. I don't think I'm going to do it because I think it won't quite look right, but I have to. Hey. I not want that. <laughs> Put the pancakes back, Oliver. I think I'll probably just get rid of them. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's a nice chair, though, but yeah, too nice. Nice for the town of Poorburg. I think these random common chairs work so much better. This place is a mess, and I love it. It's just, oh, it's like so much going on, yet it has all of the uh, necessities, which is nice. 
Oh yeah, I know Regal can be refurbished, and it looks pretty nice. Ooh, let's see how this weeping fig look. Oh, that's a big tree. I kinda like it. You know what? I think what we should do, I think we should put it like over here and then move the rock or somewhere else. Can I just cover up the sign? I can. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no poor, poor ugh, no poor bird pride. All right, uh, I don't really want this backpack here, to be honest. Like, it's all right, but I think I... Oh, no, I didn't want to grab that either. Why are you grabbing all the wrong things, Oliver? You know what? I'm going to get rid of this. I'd rather put this up on top of it. There. That looked a little bit better. I also probably don't need that hamster cage. Okay, well, whatever. Let's put the... That rock. There it is. Put the rock there. Keep the hamster. But we don't have any hamsters in town. This is part of the joke. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of this mat. I don't really like it. <laughs> Hey, you know what? I don't need it. Uh, I do feel like it'd be nice if there were more light. You know what? Let's get rid of these stupid balloons. I don't like that. I think if we can just have this uh, paper lantern light everything, that'll be fine. There. It seems so empty now. <laughs> uh, oh, I have a bonsai, don't I? I don't remember where it went. I think I put it away. That'd be nice to put on this table instead of the globe. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. I'm gonna sell some of this stuff. All right, but first, let's take this globe. Oh, I guess I have a cardboard storage unit over there. <laughs> oh, well. All right, all right, let's see. Oh, let me put away one of these bugs. I'd like someone to buy this butterfly I have, but... Might not happen right away. Yeah, here we go. The Jasmine Bonsai. This will be nice. This bonsai a friend. Hey, thanks so much, Shreepa, for the 100 bits saying, there we go, much better. Oh, that looked pretty nice there. Thank you for the bits. I'm glad you got it figured out. Sell the globe for world domination. Oh, if I can get the moon as well. All right, uh, I kind of want to keep the backpack, though. Because I know that's an exclusive item. Keep that. Okay, so is there anything here that I, I really want to keep? Not really. I think we should just sell some stuff. Uh, sketchbook. I already have one of those? So... Hey, Sharipa, thanks so much for the 200 more bits, saying, also, yay, twins, Gala arrived today, and Stitches has too. This is really exciting. Nice. Yeah, hopefully they'll both be good additions to our respective towns. Uh, I don't need this modern wall clock. I don't need this desk light. Hey, how's it going, gamers? I don't really need another lovely kitchen, but they're kind of, kind of all right. It's the Rococo table. That would be a really nice gift. Uh, oh, here's the other editor's chair. I just don't want it. Get rid of it. Also get rid of this green table. Hey, how's it going, Princess Shroob? All right. I got a full inventory of stuff clutter things i need to get rid of all right let's go just watch someone's gonna want something oh look at his house oh we have to go say hi to stitches let's do that first because he's like right on the way i love his house
It looks very different from... Basically... Oh, hi! Hey, who are you? Oh, you're the Oliver I've heard so much about. Nice. I'm Stitches. And today is the first day of the rest of my life. Coincidentally, it's also the first day I've lived in Portburg. Isn't this town just the best? Uh, is it just me or does this house look like it's made of candy? <laughs> what? Ah, uh, wouldn't it be great if it was? I would love to live in a candy house, maybe sit in a candy chair. This guy. <laughs> oh, were we talking about something just now? Well, yeah, let's be friends, stuffin'. Stuffin'? I like him. I think he'll be a good addition to town. Shall fit the poor Berg lifestyle. Alright, let's water some flowers that are dying. They're dying. Hey, how's it going? Let's play baseball curse. Hey, Eloise. So I'll talk to you first. I really wanted to get a mantis, but I just can't catch one. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. I can get you a mantis. Now, does an orchid mantis count? Or does it have to be just a normal? I bet you it probably has to be a normal one. Probably. Let's see. Hi. Perfectly fresh. So poor. <laughs> yeah. Someday. Okay. I gotta make my way on over to retail, and I gotta see what the uh, price is. Oh, all these dying flowers. Jeez. It needs to rain. It hasn't rained in like a million years. I could have sold all those gyroids for money. Need some money. I also need to get the, uh, the whatchamacallit, a log bench. We didn't ever do that yesterday. Yesterday kind of went on for a while. Ooh, that looks tasty. All right, first and foremost, what are the turnip prices? 65. So still decreasing. That is fine. Nothing at all to be concerned about. But hopefully when it is a spike, hopefully it will be in the afternoon. Those are the best spikes. Definitely the best spikes. Okay. I haven't had rain all month. I know. I don't remember when the last time I had rain was in Animal Crossing. It was, uh... Well, shoot. I've had it happen twice, and that is it. That's all. So that's not a very good thing. You know, maybe I should hold on to the regal bed. Like, as a gift, you know? Someone always needs a bed. Poor bird can't afford rain. Oh, man. All right, let's take the donut stool. And let's... Might as well refurbish the regal bed. Because if it is going to be a gift, it'll look much, much nicer. All right. Go. Rain. All right, what do you suggest? Uh, let's go with royal blue. Try to give it to Francine. Hey, hon, I got you a really nice bed. There you go. Oh, man. So, I was thinking more about the, uh... The future, if you will, um, because there's something that I I definitely want to do, regardless of which town we go with in um, uh, January. But there's something that's been missing, and that's the Cheville episodes after episode or day 83. So I located those. I had those all on my computer. I just need to upload them. In fact, actually, I already uploaded them all. They're just, you know, in queue on the Archive channel, which is where they will be. But I was thinking about it, and I was thinking, rather than release them right away, which, you know, I know a lot of people, you know, would like. They're looking forward to it. Like, oh, wait, it's a man. Um, you know, it was definitely a fun series. But rather than do that, like, right away, I was thinking about it. I was thinking it might actually make more sense 
to release it daily at 11 a.m., same time I usually would stream this, after the 50 days are up. So then you'll have something to watch every, uh, every morning or afternoon or whatever time it is for you. So, you know, even though it isn't live, it's still more Animal Crossing. And, you know, unfortunately, these, these episodes of Cheville, they've kind of been lost to time. I still have them, of course. I mean, they're not gone. My plan was always to, to uh, you know, have them uploaded. I just never got around to it. But, I, you know, my goal for the Archive channel is to have just about everything I've ever streamed on there. Anything I can get. Anything that I still have, I'd like to do that. So, um, how long did Cheville last? You know, it's kind of surprising. It actually only lasted about six months. Um... I thought it was longer than that. Enchton was the one that lasted over a year. A shirt! Wow, thanks. A waffle shirt. Hey! <laughs> nice. Uh, let's see how it looks. That doesn't look like a waffle. At least not one that I would want. Um, yeah, so there were, uh, 83 days that were uploaded across the two channels, because I was like, alright, you know what, all future channels- wait, did I ever get a dragonfly? Yeah, I did. I got the Petal Tail Dragonfly. I think it was Eloise who needed it yesterday. Um, I had 83 videos, or eight, I'm sorry, not 83 videos, also props to you, Cyrus, there's no fish in here. <laughs> 83 days worth. And, uh, the, the ones I never uploaded, they were actually quite a bit. And they will end up bringing it to a total of 111 days. So there will actually be quite a bit of content. Watch, which is nice. Hug me. And then Rory, what? Rory! Oh, Rory's moving out. That's sad. He just... Someone just moved out. That's so weird. Well, I guess Rory's the next one, which is really a shame. I like Rory. <laughs> um, it's so funny because I, I realized Rory was in Treville as well. I think we moved him in. Modern wood flooring. Uh, no, no thank you. Hey, how's it going, Jaboka? Taking it for free. Well, hey, who am I to turn down free things? Thanks! Yeah, the 100% off special. That's my favorite. Yeah. Oh, man, now I'm kind of worried about, about Rory. Well, I mean, it's okay. Like I said, he was in Cheville. But I felt like he wasn't as interesting in Cheville. Actually, it's kind of funny because his house was in, if I recall correctly, I think it was in more or less a similar location in Cheville. But, yeah. Um, anyway, I like that idea of having the Cheville episodes up as, like, a daily series. Oh, whoops. Stack my fruits. And, you know, it'll give you all something to watch. And I can just have them scheduled each day, so, you know, even if it runs through, like, um... Sword and shield, it won't be like the end of the world. Oh, here it comes. Here it comes. Sorry, no. Uh, somebody told me I've toned every muscle in my body except my coolness muscle. Can you believe it? No matter how hard I work out, I can't strengthen my image, so I guess they were right. That truth is, I need a new town. I need a place where no one knows me and I can practice looking cool. Oh, Rory. Alrighty, a move is just what I need. I'm looking at the first of next month as my new coolness birthday. All right, be cool elsewhere, Rory. Thanks for everything, cowboy. I'm excited about my life's journey. Just don't care about you slacking off in your training. No, Rory! Oh. Um, all right, so we'll do the usual rule where we'll kick him out on the 25th. We'll force him out just so we can kind of keep everything going because, you know, we only have, like, 13 days after this one. We're running out of time, so... Uh... Really crazy to think that the series is almost at its end. But yeah, um, we'll do that whether he stays or, you know, whatever. 
well, I mean, you know, sometimes they can be like, ah, psych, changed my mind. And yeah. Oh, but now we need to think who we're going to move in in his stead. Not to be a card. Not to be one that I'm not planning for whichever other town we uh, bring back, which I was thinking about it more for the, uh, we want any of this stuff. Oh, let's talk to Francine. Hello, hon. Package just delivered to my house. It's, oh, it's a Rory, okay. Sure, why not? I'll help you. Okay, so I was I was thinking about, you know, which town we pick up after, uh, well, in January. Because we hit that goal. We totally did. Be streaming more Animal Crossing in January. But, um... Which town? You know, it's not going to be a new town. It'll be either Cheville or Benchton. But... It is. Shirt! Oh, it's the dog tooth shirt I ordered a million years ago. Oh, alright. A lot of shirts today. Number three shirt. Alright. So, anyway, I've been just kind of like... I, I haven't put it up to an official vote or anything, but... I've been kind of just monitoring what people and what their excitement level is about the different things and or the two different towns either Benchton or Cheville and it seems like more people are excited about Cheville so like I'm wondering if that's just what we should go with because you know to me I really like Benchton it was you know a really important town to me but a lot of people really liked Cheville. That was what they got started with, because that was in the more modern Maryland streaming age, if that makes sense. Like, Benchton was quite early on. It was a very long time ago. And even though it was a really... Whoa, Cyrano and Chrissy. Uh, even though it was a really nice series, I loved it. It was over 180 days, or over 240 episodes worth. It was crazy. Um, <laughs> a quick hello or a love note. Oh, are you trying to tell me something? Okay, we'll write her a letter. We'll write her a love note, and it'll be, like, really short, too. Like we were going to do. Personally prefer Benchton because you know nothing about it. Would like to see what it was like. It would be interesting. It's definitely a lot more complete of a town. A lot more complete. Like, it is really solid. However, Cheville does give us more of a chance to to improve, I guess, over time. And that's a good thing, too. So, give her the bed with the letter? Oh, yes. There we go. There we go. Oh, you want that. You know you want that. Yeah. Go for it, Chrissy. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people really liked Cheville, and I liked it too. Like, it's not like I have anything wrong with it. I was gonna sell stuff, whoop. But, anyway, I'm, the more I'm thinking about it, the more I think that we'll probably just end up going with Cheville and just planning on that. Um, I think that might be better, and then I'll just have Benchton, you know, maybe I'll just play Benchton and just have fun with it, you know, I don't need to need to even stream it. But, here's the thing. I was thinking, okay, what do, uh, what do I do for, um, villagers? Like, in the past, I would just let whoever move in. Ooh. <laughs> We're not doing that anymore. We are, uh, we're gonna make it, like, paradise, all right? Because if I'm getting back to it, I want it to be awesome. So I was, yesterday after the stream, I was looking at some of the villagers that would be like, ooh, I want to move them in. Like, you know, who my dream village would be and who I'd want to keep from Cheville. So, yeah, Gladys is a must. Like, that is absolutely a must. So I know it'll be tough getting rid of some villagers, but, and this is all assuming they're all still there. I don't know if anyone moved out. 
I guess theoretically I could get anyone back because I have all their cards. Like, let's say Olaf moved out. You know, in the time that I haven't played it. Um, I could move him back in. <laughs> you know, I wouldn't want to, but I could. Uh, but anyway, the four that I'm thinking of keeping. I don't know if you guys want this to be a surprise. Maybe I'm just, like, talking too early about this. But I figure, you know, the more we can kind of plan on it together, this is really a series, will be a series that you guys helped bring back. So I feel like, you know, hearing about it and being transparent about it seems like a good idea. But, um... Last time the dream was updated was when Ronda plotted her home. I think Ronda was still the last villager to move in, so there's that. I don't think there was anyone else. But anyway, the villagers that I'm thinking of keeping... I'm thinking we need to keep four. Uh... I'm thinking it will be... Goldie and Bones, of course, because they're great. I'm thinking, um, keeping Soleil, she was also really nice. And of course, we have to keep Olaf. <laughs> we have to, he's just too iconic. So that would mean we'd have to kick out Rory and Puddles. However, we've had Rory and Puddles here. We'd have to kick out Jitters, Cesar. Rhonda, but I don't even remember Rhonda, so I, I feel bad about that. I don't think she ever really fit in. And then I think Mira. I like Mira just fine, but, you know, I think for keeping the iconic group, the originals, or not even originals, but, like, most of them were, actually. Um, I think it'd be best if we just, you know, tried to figure out the ones that are the most iconic of the town. I think those four be great. That gives me six to play around with, and I should really, what I should do is I should get some of their cards right now and just put them on the screen so we can look at them. Would you guys like that? Do you want me to do that so we can actually have some visuals on who would be in town? I can do that in a moment. Nothing too exciting going on today either. Picking some fruit. Hey, how's it going, Yanni? I should probably pick my apples as well. Stockpile them. I'll do that after I sell this fruit. Hey, thank you so much, Shreepa, for the 100 bits, saying, with all these villager discussions, that reminds me, I have both a Shavillan, Shavillan and Benchtoner in my town. I have Pico in my town as well as Goldie. Hey, nice. I want to do random villagers. I could shuffle amiibo cards in a pile and draw a few. Um, I don't want to do random villagers for Shaville. Or benched in if we go to that, but it's, I'm thinking more and more it'll probably be, uh, Bill. I think that'll be the best. I had oranges over by my house. That's where they are. All right, we'll we'll look at the cards. I'll try to have them on the screen. I think I have them all downloaded. There's actually a really nice feature on the Animal Crossing site that it, it has like all your cards. Or all of the cards, and then like a wish list kind of thing, or a collection. I don't know, it's kind of cool. I'm surprised they had that. But I can grab the images from there. There was one villager I really want to get from the, uh, the, whatchamacallit, the welcome amiibo one. But other than that, there's a few that I want. Randomize the villagers from the six I choose, so I don't know who will be moving in until they move in. Um... I mean, I don't know if that's so necessary. They'll all move in eventually. It'll just be a matter of days. Like, I see where you're going with it. Oh, I love it when villagers visit your house unannounced, Kurisu, Patchy, like... That's always fun. It's like, oh, hi. Uh, can I play on the Java Minecraft server? Uh, I need to do some work on that, but... Oh, hey, what's going on, Cyrano? Why don't we go hang out in my place right now? Alright. 
Let's do this. I think we also fell underneath the uh, supporter threshold on Facebook. I mean, even though I don't do anything anymore over there. But I'll have to look into that. Okay. Wait, you wanted to go to my house, right? Oh no, we wanted to go to yours. Okay, whoops, my bad. <laughs> Devin using Facebook? Preposterous. I kind of miss the, uh, the Minecraft world. I was thinking about that the other day. It was a lot of fun. Like, I did a lot on Minecraft, and, you know, then it's like, oh, Minecraft took off again after that. Silly, really, but, oh, well. I put a lot into that world. Put me in there, like there was last time. Zero always has me over here. Uh, you're good here. Yeah, if you could ask about, like, the Minecraft stuff on... Discord, like, I'm not playing Animal Crossing, that'd be great. Alright, let's see. But I do miss that, like, that was kind of... About. I don't think it's something I'd go back to on Facebook, but I don't know if I'd stream it on Twitch either, so... Yeah, kind of the problem. Oh well, still have the memories. Alright. Minecraft on Twitch? Yeah. Yeah, it's really prone to like trolls and kinda <laughs> not exactly the brightest people. No offense. I mean, there's some people that enjoy things. Like, I'm not trying to, to you know, paint everyone in a bad light there. I just know that there's a lot of people that just want to watch Minecraft and they might not be the most mature. So, you know, I've, I've done it before and I just remember it being like, ugh, sometimes. Drake, hey, how are you doing? Oh, I missed you, pal. Oh man, so Rory is moving out. I can't believe it. I didn't think someone would move out so soon. I mean, Stitches just got in. All right, um, what is this? Fishing vest, ooh. Be a fisherman. <laughs> oh man, it's actually tempting. <laughs> I feel like I should have it just so I can go fishing. I have the beetle helmet. Hiker vest or no go, yep. Day 37 still has Nookling Junction. I know, it's crazy. All right, I do need to buy something from here though, so hopefully that won't be enough to push it to the uh, boiling point. Buy some stationery. Rainbow paper, oh yeah. Before it upgrades the very last day. Oh man. All right. Uh, so I will, I will get the cards in a moment, or I'll try to get that going. But I figure, you know what? We'll go through all the, all the other stuff I need to do first. Um. All right. So let's write a letter to Francine. Now it needs to be just a quick one-liner that's semi-creepy. So, you know, because I like that idea. That was really funny. And we're going to send her a bed. Uh. <laughs> hey, hon. <laughs> I can just do that. <laughs> um.
Saw this bed, thought of you. <laughs> uh, so has been thought of us. Whoa. It's for sharing. Oh, man. Uh, this is some pretty bad paper, by the way. It's really crazy. All right. Um, I want to go in a different direction. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thought of us. Oh, you, you all. How do you do this? Oh, I was thinking it'd be really funny if, all right, if we move Oliver to, uh, to Cheville. Like, we were kind of talking about that anyway. But what if we move Francine as well? <laughs> That'd be really funny. I think we could do that. Um... To sleep on. But Chrissy? Oh, yeah. They haven't really interacted as much as I thought they would. Uh, let's see. Hey, hon, this bed is big enough for two. <laughs> uh, no, <laughs> let's not do that. What do you say when you're trying to give someone a bed? Like, what do you even do? Oh man, I just don't even know. Uh... Saw this bed. Eve. Get. Upgrade. And. Oh. So boring by comparison, though. Shut up and take my bed. Uh. I don't want to say shut up to Francine, though. She'd probably smack me over my forehead. This is so boring, though. All right, uh, let's, let's reevaluate here. <laughs> I know, it is. All right. Uh, sure, we'll just go with saw this bed, thought of us. People have liked that. Said it. <laughs> do I have the the winks? Do I do this? All right, all right. <laughs> uh, she'll be so confused. Did I add more of those winks? I probably could. Here is Francine. You really want me to do that? All right. My hun. There, dear Francine, my hun. <laughs> Lovely. All right. Let's add more winks. We'll, we'll do that. I feel like I've spent more time on this letter 
despite it being incredibly short. It's like I don't know how to write short letters. What? All right. Not creepy at all. M's? No, no, no M and M's. All right, all right. Hey, thanks so much, Shrepa, for gifting a sub to Tiger Fire 1974. I really do appreciate that. Nice. Can't type any more characters. What the heck? Okay. Well, we'll just take what we can get here. There. <laughs> I don't know why they're all here, but they are. All right, all right, there. Okay. Okay, it's it's been done. It's been done. Uh, yeah. All right, all right. Let's go. Let's go. I need to get, actually get my bed. But it should be ready by now, I think. Would have kept the M's just to confuse her more? I probably would have confused her. Alright, I don't think the bed is ready yet. No love, Oliver, your hun? Oh my gosh, no. Oh, it's done! Look at that. It's lovely. Weird thing is, I didn't even get it from... Here, someone sent it to me. We are ruining Porberg when we continue Cheville in January? Yes. Because then it'll have plenty of time to die. <laughs> uh, oh, I need to sell some things, too. It'll have a lot of time to get, like, weeds and stuff, because I won't have played it for a few months. Well, like a month and a half. Oh, okay, let me sell you some things here. Hey, how's it going, Nibs? This, oh yeah, the donut stool, that's right. Oh, I can't wait for there to be roaches all over Oliver's house. That'll be great. That will be great. Okay, okay, let's send this letter. This lovely, lovely letter. Take a look at it. Dearest Francine, my hun, saw this bed, thought of us, and then winky faces all over the place. <laughs> oh, I love that idea, Ed. Uh, next letter should be like, do you like Applebee's? <laughs> is the entire letter and included as a sofa. Oh, that's perfect. <laughs> oh, man. I remember to do that. Do something like really random. You just like total creeper mode and then just like completely change. Will never figure me out. All right. Uh, whoa. Right. I have to use the stylus. Of course. Well, I literally have it in my hand. I'm just too lazy. All right. So that's being sent out. Isn't that lovely. Okay. Uh, is there anything else I need to do? I need to update my dream. Wouldn't mind going to a dream as well, but I really want to take a look at the, the villagers I'm thinking for Cheville, like who our, our final, our dream team will be. I did, that's where I got the letters from. There was really nothing interesting there. Great, what a lovely family-friendly letter. Yes. All right, get everything ready. And then while you're getting everything ready, I'm going to get a few things ready as well. Uh, let's see if I can find the Animal Crossing cards.
All right, thank you for waiting. All right, great. I'll just lie down on the couch. Um. Okay, so let's do this. Have this thing load. Eight. Hey! Alright, do I have like a filter? Yes, I do. Okay, so we have Goldie. Oh, help if I spelled her name. So. I don't think I can just paste it on here. Just like drag and drop it. Hold on a second, this might get a little weird, chat. I don't think that worked. Not working. No. Oh man. All right. Let me see if I can add an image by URL. Doesn't seem so. Okay, it's fine. Let me just save these images somewhere temporary. Um. Yes, Stitches did move in. He's not fully moved in yet, but he did move in. All right. Hey. And Olaf. Okay. Now this should work. So these are the villagers I'm thinking of having. Goldie and Goldie. <laughs> of course, yes. Ah, yes. Goldie and Goldie. Wonderful. <laughs> oh, okay, let me make a folder. I can't. Try to... Also, let's get some better music. I'll go to my house. There's always pretty good stuff there. Here. A town full of Goldie. I mean, that would be a great town. I would be very fine with that. Alright. Let's just get, like, some good music going, you know? Final destination. Goldie only. No items. I really like Goldie, though. Alright, into this lovely shack of horrors. I just realized we can change the pavement. Oh, this isn't me. Actually, this is fine. Okay, okay, so. Actually, let me sit next to my... My tacos here. Doesn't Isabel have a goldy skin color? Kinda. In fact, it's actually kind of funny because for the town of Cheville, I had it so goldy and bones, they were, like, for that town's canon, they were siblings, but they were, uh, discount... Isabel and Digby. So that's pretty funny. Alright, and then Soleil. These aren't going to be lined up perfectly. And, of course, Olaf. So these are the four that we would be keeping from the, uh, the original Benchton. Or not Benchton, I'm sorry, Cheville. be keeping them. Um... Which I think is fine. I think that that's... They are the most iconic. I mean, Soleil with her throne! Oh yeah, and Tarnation! That's right, that's right. Um, 
So, like, they are in for sure. I'm, I'm wondering if I should have some text on the screen explaining what I'm doing. I think I'll do that. Hold on, where did I have that? Okay, let me just do this. Um... Uh... Alright, we'll just do that, just in case anyone's like, why are there all of these... these things? What is going on? Where's my gameplay? Alright, alright. So, those are the four from Cheville. Now, my, my dream list... Oh shoot, I don't remember... Well, we know Gladys. That's, like, an absolute 100% yes. All of my yes. Alright, so... Move Gladys in. She is so cute. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to have her back. Um, let's size these ones like over here. So those are the ones that are staying, right? So then we would be adding in Gladys. I'm so excited for her. Uh, but then think here. Oh yeah, alright, so one that I, I saw, and I'm like, oh, I really want to add him to a town. And I think he would fit in very well. I want O'Hare. I want a bunny of some sort. Like, if we're kicking out Mira, I really want a bunny. So, we'll have O'Hare, because he looks like he's down to party. And I think he'd be really great in town. Uh, alright. What else did I have? I'm trying to think. Um, because I went back and forth with a lot of these these cards. I have it over on my other computer, but I think I did it, so I don't know if I still have it saved. Wait. Yeah, it saves it on your computer, not on, like, your account. Okay. I'm not bringing Francine with me. We're going to leave that... In up in the air because actually I wanted it to be five villagers and then have like a sixth one that we can do some things with like you know maybe rotate it out every now and then um shoot I don't remember all right uh let's get this, this one. all right it's for the welcome amiibo one so it's gonna look a little weird here all right I don't know much about this cutie, but I really... Her. Look at this. Look at that. She looks like a ferret. Like, it's just such a cool design. It's just adorable. So, I, I have her card. Pretty sure. But I'd love to have her in town. I think that that'd be really neat. Having, you know, one of the, uh, the Welcome Amiibo cards. So she would be in there. And then... There were some interesting, like, other ones, but I think most of them are one of the others, uh, from the main series. Okay, so, it's three. Who the heck was number four and number five? Okay, so, I'm debating between two of them. Because I really like them, but I don't think I want both. I also don't have one of them, one of the cards, so that's <laughs> that's kind of a uh, a complication. Am I going to do one of the Zeldas? Probably not, but maybe. All right, I really like Robin. I think she just looks really like kind of sassy, and I also really like Phoebe, who I know is very sassy. Like they're both great, but I feel like with Gladys. I don't need two birds, and I feel like they have the same personality, so that's why I'm a little worried about that, but I really want to have Robin in a town, because, like, Phoebe is, she's definitely very popular, whereas I feel like Robin isn't, but I just love her design, so, I mean, maybe I'll just go with both. Theoretically, I could. I think Robin is Uchi as well. 
however you pronounce that. I think it's closer to, like, G or something, but whatever. Anyway, yeah, I like these two a lot, but I don't know if I want them both. I don't remember who the last villager is now. But this would make five. Also, if anyone's curious, this is the site I'm using. It's the official Animal Crossing site, and it's very nice. Surprisingly. Alright, you know what? I'll just, like, scroll through. It'll probably come back to me. Oh, I kind of wanted Bob. I think that's what it was. I kind of wanted Bob. I think having a cat would be good. Although, I feel like Bones is... He's a lazy villager. Oh, maybe it was Yuka. Shoot. It's like, all these villagers that I want... Alright, hold on. I'm going to put Yuka and Bob on the list. Maybe we'll have that more of a, like a decision thing. Bob, go. Alright. So we have Bob. They're like options over here. Bob is just great. <laughs> I don't know what my mom was thinking not wanting Bob. He's just... I've never had him, but he just looks so, so chill, you know? Do I have a jock type pick yet? If not, try Leonardo. I actually had Leonardo in Cheville, if I'm not mistaken. He moved out like a long time ago. He wanted to be a YouTuber. I know. Weird. Uh, I kind of like Cole, but I also don't think we need two bunnies. Well, I mean, I guess we'd probably have, or maybe have Francine as well, but... Uh, let's see... Yeah, I saw that, Shripa. You realize that you're gonna have an all-female town? That's something that I worry about, because I'm a sucker for cute, and more often than not, like, you know, the female characters just have cuter designs, so it's like, I really have to kind of control myself and be like, okay, I want to make sure that there are some boys in town. So that's why I think having, well, I mean, we'll have Bones, we'll have Olaf, we'll have O'Hare, so that's three. I'd like maybe one more, but I'm totally fine if we don't. But I don't want any less than three. Uh, let's see. Hamlet's a jock, and he's also adorable. I had Hamlet in Benchton, if I'm not mistaken. I've actually had quite a few. It probably would be a good idea to have a jock, though. Uh, let's see. Like, I know it's not going to be perfectly balanced, but that's fine. Huh, I don't actually remember then who the other one was. Maybe it was Maple. Okay, I mean, you know, we can always just leave that spot open, I guess. Oh, maybe it was Static, actually. I feel like I thought he'd be kind of cool. I think he's cranky. I like the look of Static and Yuka, you know? They just look, like, kind of angry. Olaf is smug. Yeah, he is. Static looks cranky. I don't know. I like Static. I think he'd be cool. So, yeah, here's, like, the dilemma, all right? So, we have the four over on the, uh, the right. Goldie, Bone, Soleil, and Olaf. They're, like, staying no matter what. We have Sylvana, Gladys, and O'Hare. They're also moving in, I think, no matter what. So that gives us seven. So we have three spots, but we have five villagers to choose from. I don't think we need both Phoebe and Robin. So, you know, and then I don't think we need both Static and Bob. I, I don't even know if we need Yuka, to be honest. 
I like her design. I've always kind of wanted her, but, you know, it's Melba a choice. Uh, I really like Melba a lot, but I have her in Waffles, so it's not quite as, uh, quite as necessary, I feel. Like, we can always go visit her there. Leave one slot open so we can meet new friends at random. Well, it won't be entirely random, because no one moves in randomly when you have nine. It has to be through the campsite. So, like, I'm fine if we have it rotating, where, you know, maybe, like, each week we add a new villager, then kick someone out. I forgot I had her in Waffles, too. Don't worry. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think that's about it. Other than, let me get Francine as well, which I'm still not 100% sure about, because the problem is we're probably not going to be playing as Oliver. That's why I'm not entirely sold on the idea of moving Oliver in, because what does he do? He just basically becomes like a turnip mule. So, like, Francine's kind of in the picture, but not necessarily. Friend visits your town, isn't it possible for one of their villagers to move to your town too? Yes, but the problem is they're gonna stick around for a while. And I, I'm not necessarily wanting to have, like, someone else's villager in permanently. So, you know, that's it's part of the reason why I'm doing the amiibo cards now, so then I can feel like, hey, I can visit anyone's towns and I don't have to be like, oh, I ended up with your favorite villager, but I don't really like them, if that makes sense. Um, and then also no one else can have a villager there, because it'll be like, oh, they don't just want to move out randomly. It'd be great if there was a way to do that. So, yeah, I don't know if we're going to do anything with Francine in the long run. But, yeah. So this is kind of where the, uh, the options are at. Um, these are also really good tacos, by the way. <laughs> uh, what are your thoughts, everyone? I mean, we have plenty of time for this. I think I'll move in the three on the left first. I think they're, like, guaranteed. Also, Gladys and O'Hare look so happy. Look at them. Knock either Phoebe or Robin out and get someone else. We could, or I could get both. <laughs> I mean, I'm not opposed to both. I do like birds. And they all do look pretty different, which is nice. Um, I think if I had to choose, it also would be interesting not having a cat. Like, I know I like Bob, but we don't really need a cat in town. It seems like everyone always has a cat. And then that'd leave us with these four here. So I could get rid of one of them. Probably get rid of Yuka. I'd give us then four... Yeah, four boys, right? Yeah. Oh, hair is smug. He's smug? He looks so happy, though. I think he'd be lazy. Maybe we don't go with O'Hare. Shoot. Well, what if we, uh... I mean, maybe we could replace O'Hare. There was another option that I saw. We have Yuka and Robin. That'd be three snooty villagers. Oh, right. Yuka's snooty, isn't she? Sydney's similar. All right, let's get rid of... Let's get rid of Yuka. Because that would be way too much attitude in town. <laughs> way too much. All right, so there was another option. Um, and that's Cole. I like Cole's design as well. But I don't know what his personality is. So we could potentially swap out O'Hare for Cole. Cole looks kind of derpy. But I kind of like that. No, I'm not really looking for a specific public works projects, so... That's fine. So we could, like, swap these two. Bull is lazy. I feel like Bones is lazy as well, so... I like lazy. Alright, let's just remove. We'll deal with this later. Let me, uh... Let me put all these into this group, and then I'll just hide it. Right, we'll play with that later. 
<laughs> uh, all right, all right, all right. So let's check the afternoon turnip prices. This is good planning. Good planning. Hopefully, it was at least somewhat interesting. There's a lot to plan too. Like, I don't know, but I have to think. I really want O'Hare though. I think that'd be neat. That's cool. Hey, how are you doing, huh? Huh? You want to be my boss? <laughs> okay. Uh, an old-fashioned letter. Oh yeah. Hey, I got you alone. No. Yeah. All right, what's going on? You want to replace your bird wing butterfly? Oh, all right. You know what? We can do that. That's a small thing too. How's it going, Finikusu? All right, let's see. What could I give him? Um, will the stream be going on for a little bit? No, I'm probably gonna end it really soon. Wait, what's this donut stool? That's too small. Okay. What did I give him. Small. Give him an hourglass. Ooh, I could give him the genie lamp. That seems like that'd actually be pretty cool. In his house, you know? No, the pagoda! Yeah, let's do that. That would look awesome. Yeah, it's totally fine if we share one personality. I just don't want it going too out of control. But I also don't need full representation. All right. Oh, it's not you that I need to talk to, actually. Oh. All right. Zero. I have a pagoda for you. I don't really need it. <laughs> oh man, uh, a star projector. Ooh, that sounds cool. Hey, I don't care because normal is my favorite, like personality type. So if we have three. We have Goldie, Gladys, and Sylvana. I'm fine with that. Not a big deal to me. Whoa! That is a weird thing. Yeah, you need 50 medals for Club Tortimer for the application for that. All right, I think that's gonna do it for today. I think this is, oh, you know what? We were gonna maybe do a dream town. Should I? Should I do one really fast? I feel like we spent so much time doing nothing. All right, let's do one quick random dream town, all right? Because there was a lot of exciting gameplay just a moment ago, so I feel like that was kind of... Like, I think you are all getting into it, or at least some of you were, but... I don't like it when there's no gameplay. It's kind of funny, kind of frustrating at the same time, but... So, the other day, it was like... I don't know, it was morning. It was, uh, one of the days where I didn't stream until the afternoon. It's probably Friday. And I was just, I wanted to watch something, okay? Like, on Twitch. So, I'm just having my lunch or breakfast or something. And I'm just looking through streams. Like, there were three different streams I went to. And I gave them each, like, ten minutes. And there was no gameplay on any of them. Like, one of them was Celeste. It was someone who was going to start up the B-sides on Celeste. And, you know, I'm just waiting for her to get started. And she was talking. 
all the time. And, you know, it's... Like, I get it. That's fine. It's all right. I know some people are more, you know, like, hey, let's just hang out and talk. That's really what these Animal Crossing streams are. But it was just like, I was waiting for this. And I just, I kept waiting and waiting and nothing happened. And then the same was for a uh, Fire Red and Leaf Green stream. It's going to be a speedrun. It was like just starting, but it was like 10 minutes of nothing happening. Just waiting. I'm like... Nothing happened. I gave up on all these. Then there was a Minecraft stream I went to, because I was just like, all right, well, let's see what's going on. It was like a hardcore world or something, and this guy was getting, like, so many gift subs and I think bits, but mostly gift subs, and, you know, he was thinking of stuff to do, but it's like I tuned in, and there was nothing going on. <laughs> like, it's for three separate streams, and it's just like... You know, I just kind of wait, and I, I keep hoping that something will happen, but... Oh. <laughs> so, here I am doing exactly that same thing. Well, I see paths. That's always a good sign. As far as, you know, quality goes. Because so often, um... You know, people don't bother with paths, but people that do they usually tend to be a little bit more particular of things. I think each stream is just starting. I know two of them were, but... Taking a darn long time. And then the, uh, another one was, like, right in the middle of the action. So, I don't know. Alright, uh, let's see. I like this so far. Like, it's pretty nice. Like, the paths, they're not, like, too obtrusive, too. Oh, it's Lopez. Hey, what's going on? I like Lopez. He was cool. Oh, no, it is Olaf's song. You're right. I'm like, wait, I know this song. Uh... Alright, let's see. Finny. Wait, is that, um, that sounds like a Zelda song. I don't recognize which one, like, off the top of my head. Do, do, do. Is that Song of Storms? Yeah. Yeah, that is. Weird, because it's not the- Oh, Bona, hi. Yep, that's definitely a song of storms. Anna is really cute. Like, I would definitely like to have her in town. But she's not so much of an automatic that it's like, oh, I need to have her. See, that's the thing. I want to have a good variety. Like, let's put this back on the screen for me. Because, you know, you look at this, and there's not actually that many super popular ones there. You know, I'd say... Oh, also Goldie, hi! <laughs> hi, Goldie! Let me that for just a moment. <laughs> Have fun visiting, baby! Oh, I miss Goldie. She was just such a sweetheart. Um, okay, but yeah, anyway, like, you look at this, who I'm considering here, and, like, for the higher tier ones, at least that I think of, like, Static, Phoebe, Bob, and Goldie. I don't know where Bones is on everything, but they're like... They're higher up there, but you know, like Robin, O'Hare, Gladys, Soleil, Olaf. I mean, they're not really exciting. They're not really like, you know, oh my gosh, I love this. But like, I know Fauna is very popular as well. Still not understanding the Sylvana card? Are you moving her in? Yes, uh, but not to Porberg. That'll be for Cheville when it returns in 2020, January. Thanks. Welcome. Hey, thank you, Sharipa, for the 100 bits saying, Hun and baby. Man, Oliver, you're getting all the ladies for someone being so poor. I know, right? All right, what do you have? I know. Yeah, we were just doing some planning as to, like, who we'd be in. Like, who my dream town would be. 
Alright, what pictures do you even have? Like, I don't know what you even have, if you just show me. Oh, pumpkin tea and the flag. Okay. What is the streaming schedule? So, typically, every, every day, except for Friday, I stream at 11 a.m. Central Time. And for reference, it's 12.15 p.m. Central right now. Fridays, I stream at 5 p.m. Oh, shoot. I need to update that, that command. Oh, look at that. It's, like, more or less okay. But, yeah, those are the usual times that I stream. True, Discord is very helpful for getting notifications. Schedule. It got kind of weird a little bit ago because, like, just everything was changing as far as, you know, there being events and stuff like that, so... Uh, let's see. Let's update this because I... Also, I don't update that. So, <laughs> I think I'll probably just get rid of that. Uh, I was hoping it would be, like, more useful. Alright, there we go. It's been fixed. There. I think that gets the message across, more or less. Alright, whose house is this? Norma. Can I turn 3D mode on? I mean, it's not going to work on a Twitch stream. Doesn't quite work that way. Norma. What the heck is all this stuff here? Got like a lot of milk. <laughs> a lot of milk. And two industrial fridges. Did I try? Well, I'm not broadcasting in anything that's 3D. I mean, here, I'll show you what happens if I mess with the slider. It's just going to make the screen look kind of weird. Ooh, it turns it. There's your 3D mode. Oh, that's a cool pumpkin. She lives in a warehouse? Yeah, I guess so. This is a cool bridge. I like that bridge, actually. Hey, Hopkins! Hopkins is one of the, uh, welcome amiibo villagers. I'm looking at him. Thought he could be kind of neat. You're... who are you, actually? Annabelle. Wait, what? What's that cat? Where is this cat? Part of the song? TV? Oh, is that a TV? The TV doesn't even turn on, it just makes sounds, what? It's very bizarre. That's way too big to be a radio. Oh, sorry to hear you're sick, Snake Eye. That's not good. Hopefully you feel better soon. Alfonso! Rita has KK Rockabilly too. Huh. Maybe that's it. It just, it, was, it struck me as odd, I guess. It's like, why do I hear cats meowing? Antonio! Look at that bling you got. Ooh, and a purple Rococo. Ouch, that's pretty nice. This is a pretty cool town. I like it. I kind of want to see what's inside of the house. Seen all the villagers, right? Oh, I'm so excited. So excited for Gladys. 
January. She'll be like the first one I move in. It is Pico! Hey! Yeah, Pico wasn't benched in. She was. Oh man. Alright, alright. Let's check out the house. And I I need some. I, I like the idea of having like a tree stump, like have two tree stumps kind of lined up like this by a bridge. That's actually a really neat idea. Okay. Oh, you're making your ultimate village? Nice. Yeah, that's what I'm kind of planning on. I'm trying to think, you know, who would I want in mind if I had all of the... Uh, Whoa! Love that. <laughs> oh, man. I have a bunch of amiibo cards, too. Like, I'm wondering how easy... Oh, I like this. How easy it would be to trade them. Try to complete my collection. I also like this as well. What is this? Oh, it's one of those, like, wish tag things. It should be really, really famous, like Gracie famous. I don't, I don't know this item though. Like I don't, I don't recognize it. Huh. Pretty cool though. Oh, there's not even another room over there. Wow. Also so nice. Oh, <laughs> whoops, nothing in here, nothing to see. Move right on along. That wasn't anything bad, don't worry. <laughs> oh, there's not even, wow, this is really a small house, actually. Dog? Gyrate dungeon? Oh. nice stuff in here. Like, it's not bad. It's not a bad house by any means. Not, like, huge. Person pride. Well, okay, they have this. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, my gosh, look at all this sushi! It's a plate of, like, sushi rolls. Oh, that looks delicious. I want it! I also want this coconut juice. Yeah, and a pink kotatsu. Notice that. Wow, that was some cool. Do you even have a bed? This person has a bed. Have one downstairs? Oh, they just like to. There you go. Huh. I mean, it's definitely interesting. I'll give it that. A lot of amiibo items. Yep. All right. Uh, you know what? While I'm over here, let me just get the code in case any of you want to check it out. What it's all about. <laughs> I didn't know you could put bushes right here. What? Wow, they really make that hard to get to. All right, Labrina. Oh, yeah, that's a Zelda name, isn't it? It's one I haven't played. Uh... 4F000109 Bob 7. <laughs> BOB 7. Alright, there you go. Bob 7. Not to be confused with Bob 6 or Bob 4. Don't recognize the name? I I kind of do, but I, it's from a game I haven't played. From from where? Actually, maybe it is from one I played. I think that might be the other world in Oracle of Seasons. Maybe? Yeah, I bet you that's it. I didn't recognize it at first. I was thinking it was like. 
I don't know, one of the phantom hourglass or spirit tracks or something like that. Thought the Bobs really went downhill after Bob 3. Oh, I know. That was my dream. It was, uh, it was pretty good. It's great. It wasn't like the greatest of great, but it was, it was all right. All right, all right. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you tomorrow for even more Animal Crossing. We'll need to start thinking of who we're going to move in once Rory leaves. We'll kick him out on the 25th. I think that'll be good. All right, anyway, thanks for tuning in, and I will see you tomorrow for some more Animal Crossing. Oh, yeah.